Hey guys, how are you? John James here. I want to talk about the new banger by Shawn Mendes called If I Can't Have You. Um, it's awesome. Shawn Mendes, one of my faves. Um, I'm going to do a lot less talking and a lot more explaining about what's going on. So, at the top of the song, we have a G chord, we have a D over F sharp, and we have an E minor 7. A lot of times you might get chord discrepancies when you are talking about songs and chords with other people. I just want to remind you to try to listen to songs uh, on bigger speakers with a higher frequency range. A lot of people listen to songs on their phone and the speaker on your phone is about the size of my pinky nail. So anyhow, that covers the uh, top of the song. It's G, D over F sharp, E minor seven, back to D over F sharp. And now we are in to the verse. The first chord is uh, an arpeggio, and all of these are little arpeggios, and a lot of them are triads out of the G major scale, some of them being inverted, which is kind of cool. So. Our first phrase is G, D, then here we have an A to B, that's a hammer. So it sounds like this. First phrase, done. Second phrase, here we go. Y'all with me? Good. Second phrase looks like this. F sharp, D, A. Okay? Now, that is basically an inverted D major triad. Third chord, we have a B minor. B, F sharp, D. Sounds like this. Okay? That is just a B minor triad. With me so far? Good. Excellent. Fourth chord, we have an E, a B, and a G. That is an E minor triad. Lastly, we go back to F sharp, D, and A. So you put that whole thing together, you got this. Some good information about this sick banger. Um, thanks for checking it out. Happy listening. <laughs>